Welcome to the Doggo Bake Show. I'm your host, Joanne Cabarus. We're gonna be sculpting dogs with polymer clay using minimal tools and lots of imagination. Come on in! Hi everyone, I'm Joanne and welcome to my sculpting show. If you're new to watching my show, welcome. I encourage you to watch all other episodes before this video so you can follow all the stories of our dog neighborhood. And if you've been watching my show from the start, thank you very much. I'd like to mention this before I forget. Happy Nurses Day to all of you nurses out there. I'm a day late, but it's okay. I know with this pandemic that has been going on for quite a long time now, I know how it feels like to work in the healthcare field. Hopefully, these videos and crafts may alleviate your stress while at home. Thank you for all your hard work. Today's episode is Why Maraner, the businessman. <laughs> I sold several items again. These are going to Canada. These are so fragile. I had to wrap these carefully. Those packages must be expensive. Those are gonna be mine soon. <laughs> ah, I need to pee. I'll go back there and hide. I think the packages are safe. Nobody's around. <laughs> That's what you thought. You should never leave anything valuable out here. These are mine now. Smells expensive. Ah, relieved. Oh, I better go before he catches me. I'll just take one. Ah, that felt good. Huh? 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 Uh, I'm missing a package. Weimar? What's going on? <laughs> I lost the package, Griffy. <laughs> what was it, though? It's the expensive mirror. I have to recreate the mirror again. I'll just sculpt with Joanne for now. <laughs> Under the surface, so crystal clear, everyone was really tense. Waiting down there, he had his own. Knock, knock. Weimar? What's wrong? Why are you crying? I am very sad. I just lost a package. Someone stole it from me. I worked so hard carving the design of the mirror and took me four months to make it. I hope my customer doesn't ask for a refund. You know that happens especially in business world. Yeah. Gotta prepare for these unexpected things. Well, don't be sad. Let's show them how to scope a Weimaraner, so you'll feel better. Do you like that? Okay. Okay. Preparation. Polymer clay with variety of colors for color blending. Russian baby oil. Toothpicks. Any tools with brown and pointed tip. Dogo Bake Show. Dogo Bake Books. And the Weimaraner's tutorial will be found in the Dogo Bake 3. Just follow the steps and you're good to go. Make sure the ears are big. Here 
we're connecting all the body parts together and blending the connection. This is also the perfect time to shape the general form of the body. The Weimaran are typically are tall and have skinny legs. Okay, so here's a simple Weimaraner sculpture. It didn't take me long to form it. All you gotta do is form the shapes of the body parts and put them all together. With this one, I actually use four different colors of clay. The body, the ears, and the tail are all gray. The second one would be the nose, darker brown, and then black clay for the irises, and then the light blue around it. So now we're ready to bake it. But before you bake the sculpture, make sure you smoothen the surface out with some Russian baby oil. And then there you go. Sculpture is in there. 250 to 275 degrees Fahrenheit, depending on how thick the sculpture is. It has to be on the bake in 30 minutes. I know some of you are new to these crafts and some of you may be thinking, oh, I'm not creative enough for that or I'm not artistic enough for that. This is exactly why I'm creating the Doggo Bake. It's for everyone who are hesitant to even start to have the courage to try something creative. A lot of times when I hear this from other people, when they say, I can't do that, I'm not creative enough. I created steps and techniques for, for beginners like you to start. The steps were formulated so that even kids and someone new, someone who have never touched any art supplies before can do this. I wanna make sure that the books are very detailed, detailed enough for you to be able to follow step by step and how it's gonna look like throughout the process. And I hope you all enjoy it. Mm. All right, it's done. What do you guys think? That was very easy, right? If this is your first time sculpting, you should try that kind of dog breed. Actually, all these books are designed for beginners, although advanced can also benefit from them. The skills level of each book ranges from easy, medium, and difficult. But yeah, try these books. Don't forget to grab them. Doggo Bake for Beginners. One, two, and three. You will learn 60 dog breeds to create. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel like and share these videos to your family and friends that is actually very helpful i will see you again next friday for another dog Ripa!